representing the United States of America, Karen Chen. So here is the reigning U.S. champion, and she's only 18 years of age, Karen Chen, who's currently in fifth place after the short program and better than 14 points off the lead. Your thoughts as she takes the ice here to start an Olympic year? She's already this season changed her long program from Carmen to this new piece. She's choreographed it two weeks ago. Risky. She missed her planned triple-triple in the short program. She will definitely need that in this free skate. She's feeling a lot of pressure to defend her title later this year at the national championships. And I feel she wants to prove to everyone, I'm deserving of that national title. First triple, only a double. Was a planned triple-triple combination, only managing a triple-double. Triple let's double toe loop. Teenager who is from the same hometown as Christy Yamaguchi. And Christy wrote the foreword for a book that Karen wrote and is coming out at the end of November. Also takes charge of her skating. You mentioned the switch in terms of Carmen. She has choreographed this program as well. She also made a switch earlier in the season when it came to her free skate. This is her third program she's finally landed on. It is wonderful to have full authority over every aspect of your skating career because once you're out there, you're completely alone. There's no coach or musician or costumer that can make your situation better. It's all on you. So if she needs that, then it's great. But I also think that this free program is not as strong as Carmen was. Choreographically, it's just a little bit more milk duddy. Carmen was had a lot more fire. Double axle, half loop, triple sow. Okay, I know milk toast, what it refers to, milk dud. <laughs> Were you talking in the candy? There's just sort of a soft sort of Muzak aspect of this free program. And while it's nice to listen to, to create an Olympic skating moment, I don't think this piece is going to get her there. Rushing through the takeoff on that triple loop, only managing a double. Major error on that triple sow cow. That will receive an under rotation. It wasn't even close to three revolutions. She's also in the past had a track record of these under rotations and those mistakes really add up at the end of the day. just a bit shaky but again remember two weeks ago when she should be training and and working on those finishing touches she was choreographing a new program and 
That could, I think, have been a mistake right before the Grand Prix started. She needed to really cement her position as a favorite, and it just didn't come through today. First Grand Prix of the year, but she's had other competition, and those haven't gone all that well. We'll see the numbers for Karen Chan.